Today's show is brought to you by GoDaddy. Buy your own domain name, build your site, or use any of GoDaddy's business tools and save 30%. Just go to trygodaddy.com slash HWT. That's trygodaddy.com slash HWT. Hey everybody and welcome to Hey We're Talking. It's funny because Bob, you're if you're watching the show on YouTube or Facebook, Bob, you look like really huge because I have you on a huge portion of my screen. Like well, I've got yeah, yeah, it really you, filled up. Yeah, you take up my whole screen right now because my picture is little tiny up in the corner. So, and I did move my camera in just a little yeah, bit. Yeah, you from, look you look normal. bigger. You know, that's one of the things that I've always thought someday we need to like work on a little bit is I feel like I think Derek's head is the biggest when we do this show because <laughs> of where he has his camera. And right. then mine is kind of second biggest. And usually you're like for you were further back because you're further away from your camera usually. Right. Yeah. Now. Yeah. Usually now I can actually touch my camera. Oh, gosh. Whereas whereas, whereas before um, it was another foot back yeah so i just i'm just mixing it up a little bit seeing it looks seeing good because like. your whole you're like filling the whole entire screen i do like I, it do should i be filling the whole entire screen yeah yeah I'm i like it really i, I like it now people your hair is all my nicely ugly. quaffed today you've got oh, a, man. a nice t-shirt look at that I grayish get, bl is it a gray or black it's a dark blue like a really really dark blue that's dark blue yeah. Okay. Your shirt's black. Yeah. Yeah, mine's dark blue. See, my microphone is black, and my shirt is dark blue. See the difference? I was like, look, it almost looked like a heather gray. Man, people on the... Really? <laughs> you even know that color? <laughs> it's because I like heather gray. It's a good color. I don't even know it. You would. Yeah, I've no, seen you have a not. shirt like that. Yeah, you do. You have a heather gray shirt. What is, I don't know if the listeners and or watchers or viewers can see it, but what is that thing to your left? I already showed you. Oh, you want me to show everybody? Yeah. It's, it's Batman. A little Batman figure. So yeah, fun a pop, pop heroes, a pop heroes Batman figure. It's number 141 DC superheroes. Are you collecting those? No, just select Funko Pops, I guess. And it's not. It's not sitting on top of a Playboy magazine, is it? What is it? <laughs> no, no, no. I don't know. Scott, Scott's always got things in the background that just yeah. make me wonder. I've got a Daily Bread. Do you know what that no, is? No, I do know what that is, but that's not what I'm... That's not. <laughs> I, mom, I still... My mom and dad were here, so my mom brought me a Daily Bread. She sends Cheryl and I a Daily Bread. And it's Scotty, three months you need, worth of you need to read to this. She does ask if I read it. How was... Uh, how was uh, it with them in town? For it was good. And all that it was stuff. a good. It was a good visit. Cheryl, we Cheryl and I prepared ourselves this time a little differently than we normally would. So we did a couple of different things. I was like, you know what? Part of the reason that I think that we get on each other's nerves when they're here is we don't have anything planned. Right. So I did some stuff. So we watched. Wait, well, wait, 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 we wait watched some movies. Wait. You planned something? I did because I wanted to see what would happen. See, I'm rubbing one off, rubbing off on Whoa, you. Whoa, that's uh, awesome! Yikes! Um, yeah, well, Cheryl's a planner, but I I usually deflect it when she tries to go no. Um, but we watched uh, what did we watch? Planes, trains, and automobiles, and we watched Dutch. You ever heard of Dutch? I've never seen either of those. Oh my gosh! Dang it, dude. I've heard of Planes, Trains, so you and You should watch Planes, like, Trains, is and it Automobiles. Like Danny DeVito in it or something? No. Joe Pesci? Steve Martin and John okay. Candy. I thought there was some little short guy in it. No. Oh, wasn't that Mom Throw Mama from a Train or something? Yeah, that's a terrible movie. But who was in that one? Uh, I think it's Danny DeVito and... See? That's what I was thinking of. I haven't be... seen that one either. But... I don't remember who else is in it now. Now you got me stumped. I could yeah, look it I, up, but 
I haven't seen that one either, but I just know of it. That has that lady from Goonies in it. The one who's like, yeah, 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 that old lady. You've seen Goonies, right? Yeah, a long time ago, though. I don't remember the old lady. Okay. you, Dude, as soon as you saw her, you would know. She's just like, she's terrible. Terrible. But she's the <laughs> mom in Throw Mama from the Train. Yeah, I haven't seen that. Did they throw her from the train? I think they did. You know who else is in it? Spoiler Billy, alert. Billy from a Crystal. movie from like 1980 or something. Billy Crystal is the other guy, I think. Oh, yeah, I remember. What, what has he been up to? I haven't seen he him. He does forever. stuff. I haven't seen him in a long time. He does stuff still. Huh. He's in, He did a show on FX called The Comedians with Josh Gad, and it was really funny, but they they canceled it after one season. So obviously it wasn't that funny. It was, No, it was. It just didn't get viewers, apparently. I don't know. It was good, though. I laughed. I thought it was really good. I was really bummed that it got canceled. Yeah, it seems like a lot of the shows that I thoroughly enjoy, those are the ones that get canceled. Yeah, because TV executives don't know anything. They play to the lowest common denominator. I'm going to get in trouble again. Like, So I don't like cats, and I don't like the people that are the lowest common denominator. I'm the lowest common denominator. No, you're not. No. No, it's much worse than you. Much worse. <laughs> Just think of think of somebody that watches like, uh, oh, see, if I name a show, I'm going to get so much hate mail. Yeah. We get, I'm we, starting to realize that there's certain things that I just like throw away comments that I think nothing of that offend people. And then people, people yeah. oh yeah, yeah, it's funny though, you're always going to have that. There's No, it doesn't, it's not like I feel bad, it's not like I'm like, oh, I can't believe the thing I said about the cats. I really don't like cats, partly, it's partly because I'm allergic to them, but I don't see what their purpose is. Dogs care uh, about you, I don't like cats. Uh, cats can care too. No, I just don't. I don't terrible. like the whole. I don't like the whole litter box thing. Yeah, they the poop whole... in your house, man. Well, you poop in your house. Yeah, but into a toilet. Although you can teach a cat to poop in the toilet. Now, would you, if you weren't allergic, and you could teach your cat to poop in the toilet, would you have one? No, it would creep me out if I walked in when it was pooping <laughs> in the toilet. <laughs> just hey, like can on, you, on. Can the... you hurry up, please? I really got to take a dump. <laughs> on Meet the Parents when. Uh, Robert De Niro teaches his cat to poop on the toilet. It's terrible. Oh, You've never yeah, seen that either, have yep, you? I did see oh, you that did? one. Okay. Yeah, that was with Ben Stiller. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I saw that one before. Yeah. I remember good. I remember Funny. seeing that at the theater. And even though it's not like it's brilliant humor, when they were saying his name, I was laughing so hard. It was just a funny yeah, you know, a little segment. It was. It it's was not funny. like so, a, it's not like a movie that you go, "Wow, Academy Award." No, but it's it's simple humor. Yes, very very easy humor. Let me say yes. it that way, which we try to do on this show too. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So talking about low hanging fruit, you know, yeah, that's that's try. what we do as well. We try. Speaking but it makes of us laugh. speaking of, you gonna say? Do you want me to finish more about mom and dad or no? Because I feel like I just kind of glossed over it. It was well, a good. It was a good trip. Let's put it that way. That's good. That's good to hear. I'm glad uh, you guys enjoyed your Thanksgiving time. And originally we were talking about um, having my dad on the show. And then it just kind of, you know, it was Thanksgiving and we were just kind of enjoying. And that's the other thing I was going to say about their trip this time. Usually when they come here, I don't plan out the food and we end end up eating out a lot. And then I feel miserable because we're just eating junk. And this time we planned out all the meals, like the main meals, and did some simple stuff for breakfast and had stuff available for lunch. So we didn't go out and do a bunch of like out to eat stuff, which was That's really good. good. I felt and really good. And it saves a lot of money. It it does. That's my that's my whole thing. But on but on Thanksgiving we didn't make a real turkey. We got a honey baked turkey. And those are really expensive. But they're really good. Huh. Yeah, I don't know I don't even know what that is. Like, I, I had a it was like thirty something dollars for a three pounder. Wow! But it's all meat. It's just like it's like almost like deli meat, but it's a honey baked. Oh, so it's kind of like no bones. It's just yes. a chunk chunk of it's meat. It's just a big chunk of turkey breast, and it's huh. really it tastes really good because it's got that. You've had honey baked ham before, right? Yeah, yeah. It's got that sweet stuff on the outside. 
I just don't put that extra crap on it that they it comes with. No, I don't put any extra like the stuff glaze, on it. the no. honey glaze. I don't put that on there. No, that's g- gross. All right, now we're boring people. So jokes, low hanging fruit. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you sent exactly. me stuff through email, and you go, "We're going to do this on the show." So tell everybody what your idea is here. So yeah, I just uh, was thinking about it and uh, stumbling upon doing a whole bunch of research for the show. Just stumbled upon a, a list of. 50 corny cheesy jokes and i thought it would be fun to see if we can get a laugh out of any of them (laughs) that's all (laughs) and i was telling bob there's a there's actually like i don't know if it's a a people that the one that i just saw recently was will ferrell and um marky mark mark Wahlberg. mark because they've got the new movie daddy's home Two or whatever so they told each other dad jokes on a YouTube video. Right. And it's part of, there was a group of people that I also saw do it that I thought did it on a regular basis, but they had them do it. And it was pretty funny. So they, tr- what well, they, you, what they you try to do like, is like not laugh. No, it's, no, this will be fun. <laughs> but what they do is they keep score. So you read your joke and if I laugh, you get a point. But if yeah. you laugh while you're telling your joke, I get a point. So do I need to keep points? No, we'll just, I'm just saying the, there's something similar to this, but you didn't know it. And it's, so it, that means it's a good idea, Bob. You didn't know about it and you thought of it. Well, now I'm going to have to go. If it's, who did you say? Uh, Mark, Marky Mark, as you said. Yeah. And Mark Wahlberg Will, and Will Ferrell did it. I'll find the, I'll put a, I'll, up. we'll have to put a link in the, in the video to it because <laughs> it's pretty funny. Yeah. I'm going to have to write that down. I did see one. Um, one thing that, I don't know that maybe that's kind of what put me on this path was it was the rock and, um, yeah. Kevin Holt. yeah, but they were telling jokes. They were, they switched roles for an interview. Yeah. So Kevin Hart yeah. was acting like the rock and the rock was acting like Kevin Hart. Okay. And I just thought, Oh, some kind of back and forth yeah. like that would be cool. And you know, I kind of tabled that and then found these jokes and I'm like, <laughs> that'd be fun. So kind of stinks that somebody already did it. I wish you would have. Shot it down right away, but no, I thought it would be funny. So let's let's jump into it. Let's do some before we have to take a break. Okay, we got like three three minutes or so. Go ahead. I'm I'm keeping score. You should go ahead. You can shoot one out. Let's see what you got. Look at I accidentally gave you a point already. Why? (laughs) I don't know. (laughs) Don't take take that away. I don't get a point yet. Right. Well, I'm sure you will at some point. So okay, we'll start with the first one. Okay. Uh, How many kids with ADHD does it take to change a light bulb? How many? Let's go play on our bikes. I think that one's been done in every facet. And no, I I thought about laughing, so really? but I have to. I had to like take a moment and keep my mouth from smiling. Yeah, that that one's been played out in many different ways. Right. Want to go fly a kite? Ooh, okay. a baseball. Here we go. You ready? Yeah. <clears throat> I don't. Okay, that's a point for you because I already started laughing once I figured out the joke. Okay. It's hard to explain puns to kleptomaniacs because they always take things literally. That's good. That's that's actually really I know. Good. That's kind of a brilliant joke. That's why I laughed. I'm going to have to send that one to my buddy Jake because he'll he'll like that one. You get it? Should we explain it to people or do you think they got no, it? No. Okay. If they don't get it, it's okay. okay. We'll just move on. Okay, go ahead. So what do... What do you call a dangerous? <laughs> wow. Okay. I had to just look and, and read what it was. That's a big word. What do you call a dangerous precipitation? I don't know. A, re- a rain of terror. Hmm. Not, not good. Okay. Not good. I used to think the brain was the most important organ. Then I thought, look what's telling me that. <laughs> you laugh. Laugh. that counts that's a point and i yeah, laugh too though so that's two you get a point also that's probably because it was just stupid it was I mean, but it's it's somewhat creative okay do yours what's the best part about living in switzerland mm-hmm. not sure but the flag is a big plus that's again smart i just kind of giggled yeah i that's i'm not gonna okay. count that that's you know a big plus Okay, I'm going to get in trouble for saying this word. The midget fortune teller who kills his customers is small, medium, at large. Uh, there was a lot of info on that one. Yeah, it was a little it was a little deep. 
a little more difficult to digest. They can't all be gold, people. Go ahead, Bob. No, not at all. Uh, two fish are in, in a tank. Mm -hmm. One turns to, to the other and asks, how do you drive this thing? Get it no. in a tank? Yeah. Okay. A farmer in the field with cows counted 196 of them. But when he rounded them up, he had 200. It's a math joke. Rounding up. Oh, that's stupid. Man, that's I don't weak. round up. I'm straight up with the numbers. Like that's my weak. wife, she'll always she'll always be like, "Well, that bill's going to be $100." No, it's like 75. Man, but that's a big basically 100. But that's a big round up. Well, that's what my wife does. She's like, and then <laughs> so she takes like, the extra 25 and puts it away somewhere. Yeah, and probably in a Swiss <laughs> bank account. Okay, do yours. Uh, why can't a bike stand on its own? Because it's too tired. That was, that was pretty good. That was, that was pretty a good, good one. How many have you done five so far? Sure. Okay. What does a nosy pepper do? Hmm. Get jalapeno business. Like get all it up. all up in you. It's supposed to be like all up in. Get jalapeno business. That's pretty pretty bad. I should have read it before. No, I'm not <laughs> I just reading read these. it out loud. I'm not reading these before, and we. I sense got this list, and I'm like, don't read it until okay. we're ready to go. And I didn't read. I don't know what joke Scott has. So okay, wait, 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 what? wait. Let's take a break and come back. <laughs> Are we going to keep doing this? <laughs> I don't know. We'll okay. See. It's some, there might be some good one. What if we run on into something good? Okay. We're going to be Let right it, back. I'm going to lead into it with this. So we'll get a little cliffhanger. Why didn't the lifeguard save the hippie? Fast, simple, and affordable. That's what registering your domain name with GoDaddy will be. Fast, simple, affordable. And if you listen to this show, Hey, We're Talking, you know you're getting a discount. 30% off. If you go to trygodaddy.com slash HWT. Again, 30% off. All you have to do is go to trygodaddy.com slash HWT for 30% off your domain name and other business services provided by GoDaddy. Hey, everybody. It's Scott from Hey, We're Talking. You've heard us talk about Gamefly.com before. The basics are this, they've got over 8,000 titles for every gaming platform you can think of, and they're giving you a 30-day free trial. That's right, 30-day free trial for you, the listeners of Hey We're Talking. You want to play video games? You want to be a champ at video games? Go to GameFlyOffer.com slash HWT. That's GameFlyOffer.com slash HWT for your 30-day free trial. Hey, we're back. And, we uh... Wait, before you give the punchline, we're telling jokes. They're they're kind of stale jokes. They're and we don't know the jokes. We're just reading them out loud. Bob sent us these jokes. He's got a list and I've got a list and we're going back and forth here. There have been a couple that were slightly humorous. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And we're just trying to see if we can find some some gems here. So why didn't the lifeguard save the hippie? Because he was too far out, man. See? I almost laughed. It's close. Very close. I almost close. laughed. Okay. What is Bruce Lee's favorite drink? Hmm. What? Wow. What? Oh, that's kind of racist. You know how he made, a little. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, we both laughed. No, we. it was long enough um, after. Go ahead. Last night, uh -huh. I almost had a threesome. I just needed two more people. He went dirty. And that's what, hey, it is what it is. The dyslexic devil worship sold his soul to Santa. <laughs> no. See, that was good. I don't, I don't know good. why that was, I don't even know why, but that was why, funny. Why is it that there's certain things like dis, dis, I don't, I can't even say it, dyslexia, dyslexia that sometimes can be used for humor that make us laugh. Uh, it's it's because we're real... sick. It's a real disease that people yes, have, Scott. I, I don't think it's funny that you make jokes of it. Sold is sold to Santa, though. Why do you, what do you call a big pile of kittens? A mountain. Oh man, I'm holding it. I'm holding that. Okay. A that was that was close. You kill vegetarian vampires with a stake to the heart. 
Yeah, yeah I understand that. Like, uh, but, like a steak, though, like well done. Right, yeah. Oh, would it be well done? Medium rare. No, they'd probably like it rare. They would like it rare. You yeah. want all the blood out of that thing. Right, so they can drink <laughs> blood. <laughs> the little actions has made it even better. Okay, go ahead. I was wondering why the baseball was getting bigger, and then it hit me. <laughs> I'm trying not to laugh at these. They're so stupid. There was a prison break, and I saw a midget climb up the fence. As he jumped down, her sneered at me, and I thought, well, that's a little condescending. What does that even mean? I'm not sure. As he jumped down her, oh, there was a prison break, and I saw a midget climb up. What? No, it doesn't up even the make fence. Sense. Up the fence? I don't get this one. Someone's well, going to have to explain that to us. That just shows that we didn't preview these. No, <laughs> I can't even read it right. I don't know what's going on. I don't understand it. Okay. Atheism is a nonprofit organization. That's very true and true. And it's funny. Yeah. If you want to catch a squirrel, just climb a tree and act like a nut. Yeah. That's. <laughs> There's this one. The ne my next one's kind of dirty. I don't know if I'm going to do it. Go ahead. I just went to a very emotional wedding. Even the cake was in tears. That one. You no know, different tears. Of oh, the cake. okay. Gotcha. T i e r s. Yes. I can't. I don't think I should say this one. Should I say it? Yeah. I mean, it's on the Dude, list, it's man. It's too. It's dirty. Unless it's unless it's like. So this guy with a premature ejaculation problem comes out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> See? That's terrible. <laughs> that's terrible. My parents no, are so sad right now. That's no, that was that's good. Okay. I like that one. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Oh, okay. I want to repeat it, but I'm not going to because it needs to be repeated. Okay, go ahead. When you get a bladder infection, you're in trouble. That's true. Yeah, that's a big that's a, a big uh, no no. A magician was walking down the street and turned into a grocery store. Yeah, that was He turned well, into a grocery yeah, store. That, it's wide it's open. Man. Weak. I, yeah. I wrote a song about a tortilla. Well, it's actually more of a rap. That's pretty good. Yeah. Okay, this one's been done, but let's see if it gets you. So a blind man walks into a bar and a table and a chair. No. Yeah, see, I always wait for something more with those. Yeah, usually it's, it's like misdirection. Blind, so. They say something and then they say something that you would never expect. That's when those are funny. Go ahead. What do you call a dinosaur with an extensive vocabulary? I don't know. A thesaurus. That's good. That'd be a really good kid joke if you taught your oh, kid yeah. that. Yeah, especially if they were learning that in like English yes. class or something. Yeah, that could would tell be. their teacher. Yeah. Uh, why don't you ever see hippopotamus hiding in trees? Why not? Because they're really good at it. No. I don't. I don't understand that one either. Because they're just they're so good at it that you never see them. Oh, okay. See, yeah. you had to even explain that. I'm a simpleton. Okay. How did the hipster burn his tongue? How? Oh. He drank his coffee before it was cool. That's kind of funny. No. Uh, again, this one's not racy necessarily, but it's pushing the boundary here. Did you hear about the Mexican train killer? No, I didn't. He had locomotives. You almost, if I would have done the voice better, you probably would have laughed. Yeah, that was close. If I was like, he had locomotives like that. Yeah, maybe. Really stereotyped it up as much as I could. Which is. Man, we're going to get so much hate mail for these. Go ahead. PMS should just be called overreacting. Oh. I made it through. I was, I was going to okay. laugh. Yeah. How does NASA organize their parties? How do they? They plan it. <laughs> I 
<laughs> some of these, I'm telling you, some of these, you have to really catch yourself. Okay, go that, ahead. That, yeah, you're you're destroying me here, and I'm I'm. My I don't think you're counting low. all the ones I'm laughing at, though. I don't know. Okay, go ahead. Uh, marketing companies should use chromosomes and advertisements because sex sells. See again, like all these that you're doing, I would laugh if I wasn't making myself not laugh. Just let it go, man. No, that, I'm trying not to get. I don't want to lose. Why can't you hear a pterodactyl go to the bathroom? Why can't you? Because the P is silent. That'd be good for a vocabulary class. Again, that'd be a good kid joke. Okay. Did you know that pampered cows produce spoiled milk? Again, I came really close right there. You could see the the corners of my mouth curl up. Just let bit. it go, man. Just be free. Oh, I Set wanna, yourself I want to win. <laughs> what kind of shoes do ninjas wear? I don't know. Sneakers. Yeah, because they sneak around. They're ninjas. Yep. Mm. Ooh, I almost laughed. I was just thinking about this one. You should learn sign language. Why? Because it's very, it's very handy. It's okay, man. Just let it go. Uh -uh. It's all right. Just let it go. Why does Snoop Dogg carry an umbrella? Why does he? Faux drizzle. My nizzle, yeah. Drizzle. My nizzle. Get it? When it... You can't say... Yeah. You can't say nizzle. Is that a bad word? Yeah. Oh, okay. You're You're a white guy. You can't say nizzle. Oh, I didn't even know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. I, I started a band called nine, 999 Megabytes. We haven't even gotten a gig yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a buildup of all the ones I couldn't laugh at. I guess. All right. Did you hear about the new corduroy pillows? I did not. They're making headlines everywhere. Oh, very good. Yeah. Yeah. Here you go. Corduroy pants. Whatever happened to corduroy pants? Mm. I see them once in a while. Somebody wearing them. Not a fat guy. Causes a friction know. fire between oh, their legs. I, oh, oh, I remember hearing that from people before a long yeah. time ago when yeah. I was a kid. Just When I was a little pudgy ah, kid, ah. I would wear those and then go down the hall. It's terrible. My crotch would catch on fire. You want to hear a pizza joke? Yeah. Never never mind, it's cheesy. All right. Nothing? Wow. Dude, you know I'm trying to stop. Why was six afraid of seven? Oh, gosh. Because seven was a well-known six offender. Very timely. Ooh. Wow. I didn't expect that Again, one. Again, another one that people are going to be like, that's uncool. Why would you even have a joke like that? Six. Well, that's what happens when Bob sends them to we to us, and we don't yeah. even read them. Yeah. Go ahead. What's the difference between ignorance and apathy? Don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't care. <laughs> Pretty good. Here's a stupid one. You ready for this? Yep. What time is it when you have to go to the dentist? What time? Two thirty. Yeah, I think I think I heard that from my dentist when I was a little kid. So that joke's been around a long, long time. Oh yeah. Let's see. Oh, dry race boards, they're remarkable. They are. Another another well thought out joke. That is pretty good. My friend recently got crushed by a pile of books, Ooh. but he's only got his shelf to blame. Pretty good. Yep. Hmm. I only got two left. Go ahead. I do too. Okay. What do you know? <laughs> Dwarfs and midgets have very little in common. <laughs> Dude, you knew you were gonna laugh at that one, didn't you? I was just I was just waiting for you to to <laughs> let go so I could I could laugh. Okay. What did Jay Z call his girlfriend before they got married? What do you call her? Fiance. Oh, instead of Beyonce. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wow. Okay. <laughs> so okay. stupid. It's funny. Go ahead. How do you make holy water? 
boil the hell out of it. <laughs> and with that laugh, do you have any more? Yeah, I got one more. Uh-oh. It better be good because I'm ahead right now. Time flies like an arrow. Fruit flies like banana. They do. They do. It's very true. Every if time you, you have get bananas, bananas in your house, you will get fruit flies. Okay, well, I'm I'm the champion of the very first and only ever. I joke gave up left. at the end. I stopped trying. No, my jokes just got better as as time went on. I wonder what people. I really want to know what people think of this when they. Well, see I want to know. I want to know people's corny jokes like this. So yeah. that, that's that's kind of my mission is to find out. All right, let me hear your corny jokes. Derek, top Derek would have been really friends? good at this, by the way. Oh yeah. Yeah, he Derek's has got... that really dry delivery. He would have been really good at these. Yeah, yeah, his delivery would have got us a whole bunch of times. I think. Probably, and his. And he would drag him out too. <sighs> would drag him out though. Derek would be like, "Hey guys, why do you think the fruit flies?" <laughs> exactly. Bananas, <laughs> guys. Bananas. And we'd be like, Derek. Derek, continue come on. on. Man. Oh, that was the joke. That was it. I sound like. And then he would know. go. Then he would go. Check out my YouTube channel. Yeah, DerekJTan.com. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know why we decided to do this just for fun. Just yeah, just for, to laugh. Just to change it up a little bit. I got some good laughs out of a good cheesy fifty joke. Hopefully, so. hopefully some people laughed. Um, by the way, Derek, it's not like he. He's didn't show up or something, whatever. I think we told you guys he was going to be working like a really long, like seven days, 12 hour days straight. So that's why he's not here. Yeah. So you he's guys got to deal with us. Yeah. But he'll be back. So if you're just like, oh, I hate when it's just Bob and Scott, you know what you can do? You can shut up, first of all. And then no, secondly, yes. Yeah. I, I'm trying to remember who told me the other day they were like, I don't like when it's just to you and who did they say? They were like, I don't like when it's just you and Derek. And I told them, I go, well, I don't care what you think. <laughs> <laughs> who said that though? Do you know? I don't remember who or was it. Was it somebody you don't want to call out on the, uh, no, on the I'm trying to remember. Well, I just want to be friends with that person. Cause that means they like me being on the show. Yeah. Um, speaking of last little anecdote here before we run. My, I talked to my brother over the holiday. He does not listen to the show. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But do you remember me telling you about that guy that works with him that goes and tattletales on me when I talk yeah. about him? Yeah. Which I barely ever have done. But um, this guy, like, routinely, his new thing is he doesn't like the church that I go to. So he goes, dude, your brother, He, he, he his pastor is crazy, dude. Oh, so he goes and tells my brother and they discuss it. So, you know who you are. I need to give him something juicy to go tell my brother. Um, I I got nothing. I got, I mean, that's, that's, you have to think of that. This could be a new shtick. I kind of like it. It could be kind of funny if we could think of things to get him to see. I'm not saying his name. I almost said his name. Yeah. I'm listen. I'm joking with you too, by the way. Even though you do go tattletale on me. Yeah, Greg. It's not Greg. Mark. <laughs> if you said his name, Bill. I would probably start laughing so hard. No, it's not Bill for sure. That's why I'm thinking it's Mark, because you did chuckle pretty no, good. No, 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 no. If you said it, I would I would be like, oh my gosh, you said it. Gloria. Yeah, that's it. How did you know? Oh, Gloria. Gloria. That's yeah, a right. weird name for a guy, but, but okay. Yeah. All right, Steve. All right. <laughs> not Steve <laughs> either, but that was funny. Oh, okay. All right. So, uh, hey, uh, thanks for listening to this show. I don't, I don't know how to end this one because I, we should have saved one really good joke to end the show on. Tom? No. no. <laughs> Trying to find this guy's name. All right. So, anyway, we will be back. We've got uh, more shows for you this week. We're excited. We are going to be derek but that shouldn't stop you from listening to the show. No, because if you are a huge fan of Derek, then you can come on here and complain that Scott and I do, don't do a good enough job. And we'll talk about Derek still. We'll say stuff. We'll make fun of him, even though he's not here. Because we make fun of him when he's here. We'll still make fun of him. Right. Don't worry. It's okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's easy. No problem. Yeah. So so we've got uh, more shows this week. 
and and Bob knows what the show's going to be about. So uh, we'll see you soon. We love you. You're the best. Even Wait, the people that don't like us. You. What's are that? You supposed to say, are you supposed to say we love you? Do, yeah. I mean, do you actually love I these love guys? our so, listeners. So here, let me plug this real quick. So we've got some guys. Uh, Dude, you're, we're no, way over. I don't care. We got some friends of the show called Creator Cast. They are basically oh, a guy. group of YouTube guys that have got together, formed a YouTube channel, which we'll put that in the bucket below. But they j- just had an episode about that is, do you actually love your listeners? Like, do you love them? Because the meaning of the word love has a certain meaning to it. So do you there's, love the listeners? There's many different uh, versions of the word love. And I love our 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 listeners. It's an agape love. It's a friendship love. Oh, that's so nice. I don't love them eros, which is the sex love. Ooh. Ooh no. Sorry, folks. <laughs> Sorry, folks. Folks, I like that word. I folks. like how you got Creator Cast in there, though. You see that? Well, because you said you're going to leave and go on Creator Cast and be a they, featured person on there, aren't you? No, I'm gonna. No. I'll, I'm gonna try to get on there at some point, but I'm gonna also try to get them on our show as well. Well, Danny's so, on Creator Cast. You need to tell him that, Danny Black. Yeah, Danny Black is on Creator Cast, but they actually have a really awesome show that talks about uh, what. If Do they talk about to, creating stuff? Yes. And oh wow, cast, that's a great name. It's a cast of characters too. It's almost like Hey We're Talking talks about stuff. Right. But they create <laughs> casts. Yeah, they got some really cool vloggers on there. They do. And these guys are they've got a really good flop following and they'll teach you um how to vlog and how to what equipment to buy and all that stuff. So the one dude out. is they're completely awesome. fearless. I wish I remembered his name. Do you know who I'm talking about? He will vlog anywhere. He's the best. He's really Bennett? good at it. Benin? Is he the guy that went on the cruise with Danny? Uh, Yes. Yeah. That yeah, guy will just vlog it up everywhere. It, he does awesome. not care. He, he's he's awesome. He he does. He I just I was watching a couple of his vlogs, and he does these middle of the night, like four in the morning, four minute vlogs, and just <laughs> talks about. They're to pretty create. smart, though. Yeah. yeah, to create. Yeah, he's so, fun. He's fun. He'll but, be in the middle of the conversation, and he hits that four minutes, and... The video just shuts off. It's like, <laughs> wait a minute, I was watching that because he doesn't edit them or anything, unless his battery dies or something like that. But okay, all right. Okay. So, Creator Cast, we went way over. Damn, it doesn't we way over. We make the rules. It's our show. I know. All right. Thanks for listening. We'll talk to you guys soon. 